It's around 6 p.m. and I am going to the beach. I know you're probably wondering why am I going to the beach at this time. Well, I'm actually going to a nude beach to see some naturism. And um, I go there sometimes, I have to be honest. I like being free. And um, after 6 o'clock, you don't have to pay for parking. I'm just going to go and relax, you know, after working. We're going through the do not enter. You're not supposed to do that, but I don't know why they're blocking the entrance now. It, it's actually always open when the guard leaves, but don't copy me. <laughs> You're not supposed to do that. Let's just find parking and be there for, you know, half an hour. It's good to relax, you know, the beach, the ocean, it cleanses you and it uh, clears your mind. So. Over Park Beach, there's a little thing that separates it from the regular beach. And you see a lot of people that are nudists that come and still sit in the regular side. So that means that it doesn't bother, bother them either. Um, it's just a, a state of mind, you know. I mean, we're all born naked, so what's the big deal? Let's go. regular part where you're not supposed to be without clothes and then when you pass that side that's when you can be without clothes. Attention. Be young. Welcome to the nudist beach. Out over park. The beach is the beach. There's no difference. I mean you have people that go topless, you have people that go naked, you have people that go with bikinis on. They're huge and then you have people that go with really really tiny bikinis that they might as well be naked. So in the end it's no difference. If you want to come here, you want to tan, you want to be in the water, whatever it is. I stopped somebody. This is fabulous beach. It's uh, all freedom. It's beautiful. You just got to be respectful and free, right? Exactly. Cancun. You know, if you see Cancun Caliente, you'll know. <laughs> Hey, yeah, the first beach ever was in 1976 in a National Nude Beach Day in New England, California. That was the first uh, beach movement that happened here in the U.S. So that's very interesting. And then uh, late 1970s, you have skinny dippers uh, common at Virginia Key near Miami. So skinny dipping is, is um, interesting too. <laughs> so the first one was Oregon, then Vermont, then California, then Florida, then Kentucky, then Ohio, then Washington, and yeah. <laughs> so um, it's already past 7.30 and usually around 8 you have to go, you know, they close when it's uh, sundown and there's always a person that walks by at that time and they say, Hollywood Beach is closed and you gotta leave, if not you can't take out your car after that and everybody just wants to come here to be free and that's it. Now I have to go home. <laughs> 